folks. Welcome back to JTML 9681's LPs. I'm your host, JTML 9681. And we are still currently playing Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explorers of Time for the Nintendo DS. This is part 25 of our adventure. <clears throat> and that brings us back today. Presently, Dust Noir and I have been working out a new strategy. While we develop the strategy, we ask you to search for the time gears on your own. That is all. Work hard again. What is it to go search on our own? Where should we go? I wonder. We can search all we want. But we don't have a clue. Oh, wait a second. Yesterday. Yes, that's right. At the pits. We assumed that there was a dead end, but maybe there's a secret. Hey, what's up? Are you daydreaming again? You want to go back to the desert? But we searched her yesterday. There wasn't anything there. Wait a minute. We were there, you had a sensation like you had at the lake? Oh, okay, if you say so. Let's go out there again, back to the desert. No, I wanted to read some more uh, journal, but there's not enough right now. I think I may have meant to sell that before and forgot. Steel Wing! That's actually a pretty good what, uh, move right there. But I don't have any flying Pokemon. At least not that I use with, with me. Quick Sand Desert. Well, we're back, but still seems like there's nothing here. Just this white sand stretching out. And pits, obviously. Is there something more here? What kind of secrets lie here? I have a feeling it's very faint. I do know it somehow. Looking over this, I have to admit, Total's right. There really is nothing here but desert and quicksand pits. And aside from those pits, there's nothing. Wait a minute. If there's only quicksand, that's the key. There's no way forward. Or is there? What do you think? Where should we look? Dive into a quicksand pit? Are you serious? You really want us to jump in there? Alright, I'll trust you on it. I have faith in you. Well, it's, it's all thanks to you that I've come this far. Well, here we go with more stories. I put my faith in you last time, too. Hmm. My feelings haven't changed since then. Let's go for it! Ah! Ow, my backside! Hey, where are we? Is this a cave? We dropped through way up there! Hey, you were right! There, there was a secret about it! Well, let's roll. Time to find that time gear. Ow! 
Ow! Jerk! Did it again. I don't know if it's just on the floor or if it's from now on. It, it doesn't say, so I may have just wasted both of those, but whatever. Oh, more grimy food. I don't want to pick that up. Only one Pokemon can actually benefit from that. Exciting. Uh huh. How'd you get over there? Uh, vital throw? Uh, nah, I... Actually... Nah, uh, I'll forget about that one.
Yeah, it was already here. I didn't see it. Another spurn orb, nice. through the quicksand pits. Oh well. 
I learned a new move. What's this? Up the two tiles away. I'm gonna forget about that move. Yeah, I'm gonna forget this move. Their levels are not far behind us now. Just 
still using that 360 D-pad. The game won't let me go in an angle with the joystick, with the analog stick, very well. So, that's why you see me going all over the place like that. Because of the 360 D-pad, at least it lets me go in an angle. Underground Lake. This. Fantastic! I wasn't expecting this. Huge lake sprawling underground like this. Hey, there's something glowing way over there. That light. I'm sure we've seen that before. That's it. That's the same one we saw at the lake. It could be coming from a time gear. Let's let's take a closer look. Uh, it, it went dark all of a sudden. What? Who are you? Where's that voice coming from? Why did you come here? Why? Well, we came to look for a time gear. Stay away from the time gear. If you won't leave the time gear alone, I'll stop you. Who are you? I'm Esprit. Think of the female. In this deep underground lake, I protect this time gear. You protect it? I won't allow you to disturb it. Now get ready.
can't let you take that time gear. Listen! We keep telling everyone we didn't come to steal it. Don't lie to me. Uxi used his telepathy to tell me what happened. I know that time gear was stolen from Fogbound Lake. You heard from Uxi? That was your doing. No, it wasn't us! Then who's responsible? That would probably be me. Who are you? Grovile! That's Grovile! I must apologize. But I will be taking that time gear. Ah! Stand aside. I won't. I won't let you take it. I have no choice then. Ugh! Mesprit! Mesprit, Mespirit, whatever. You lost that fight. You sustained serious damage, so don't push it. You're not getting by us. We won't let you take this time gear like that. Alright. I'm sorry about this. Ah, it's so fast! Forgive me, I have no quarrel with any of you. But I'm taking the time gear. Time gear, that thief! I I'm sorry, Ux, he must not have been talking about you. It was that Pokemon. Sorry for doubting you. Oh, this is bad. We have to get out of here. Wh why? What's going on? It's happening because that thing took the time gear. So time in this whole area will stop all around us. What? If we don't hurry, we'll be trapped. Run for it. That's not running. <laughs> All right, everyone, that's going to be it for part 25 of Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explore the Time for Nintendo DS. Stay tuned for part 26. As we continue our adventure, JTML9681 signing off. I'll see you on the next part.